Fox Carolina First Alert weather. Well, let's, let's go from that kind of crazy to some crazy weather. We've got uh, rain taking over and a big drop in our temperatures ahead. Downpours for early on Friday. Now that's going to be your best chance of rain on Friday. Second half of the day into your evening. Still some spotty showers, but the most impactful weather comes early. Cold showers all day Saturday. Just about a washout, unfortunately, and temperatures in the 40s and then clearing for Easter Sunday. So at least for those sunrise services, for egg hunts, for a Sunday brunch, it shouldn't be pouring at all. But clouds may take a while to get out of here. First alert radar is all clear. We had some showers earlier, even a couple rumbles of thunder around Rutherford County, southern part of the upstate. But now that's over. We'll be looking ahead to showers moving back in later tonight. 61 in the upstate in the mountains, mid 50s on the way. So first alert weather days for Friday and Saturday. Notice highs in the 60s, so it's not going to warm much from those morning temperatures. And then 40s Saturday, then the mountains and upstate will be in the upper 50s by Easter Sunday. And the rain should be done. We should get a lot of sunshine in the afternoon. So that's our next big thing. It's this rain that's going to be moving back in over the next few hours. In fact, there's 6 a.m. Heavy downpours across the 85 corridor, heavy rain around the mountains at 9 a.m. We'll continue to see off and on showers, but you notice the lull here by about 5 p.m. With the exception of the northern mountains, most spots are not seeing much rain. But here it comes again, unfortunately, Saturday morning. And remember what I said about Saturday, it's kind of an all day thing. Yeah, it kind of hangs on. So it's going to be fairly light most of the day. There's 3 p.m. But watch the trend here. After 7 p.m., it's out. And here's Sunday morning around sunrise. While it breaks in the clouds, we might actually get to see the sunrise. I'm keeping my fingers crossed, but at this point, uh, I just at least say that I don't think there's going to be rain happening early on Sunday. One to two plus inches will be possible. Heaviest amounts will be in the upstate. And there's that sunrise service forecast. Some fog possible in the upstate. Low 40, so chilly for sure, uh, but otherwise not the soaking rain, which is nice. As we look ahead, we'll have some beautiful weather next week. It's sure it's it's unfortunate we can't take Tuesday and Wednesday's weather and plop it into Friday and Saturday, but that's just not how it works. So we'll have to get through that rain. Uh, but by Sunday, much more uh, enjoyable weather to be outside in the mountains. Same scenario. Got to deal with that rain. Flooding threat looks low since we're only going to see about one to two inches, but enough to get some ponding of water on roads. So be careful out there. And that leads us to our riding forecast. It's sponsored by Harley Davidson of Greenville. If you're going to be on those roads this weekend, just know that Saturday is not a great one for being on the bike since it will be raining pretty much off and on all day. But Sunday, those roads starting to dry out. It's going to get warmer too, so I think you'll enjoy it. It's just going to be breezy uh, with winds out of the northeast. In the mountains, upper 40s on Saturday and then upper 50s on Sunday with some morning fog, but otherwise a very nice afternoon. Now be sure to check in on the morning news from 4.30 to 10 a.m. for the latest on your forecast as you get your day started. And you can stick around for Access Carolina and the midday news. You can get your forecast really anytime between 4.30 and noon.